Hey, we're for today. And you're watching APTV. Break the cycle. So we are sharing 10 facts that fans may not know about for today. The first one um, is that I uh, was a, a good soccer player. Um, for a while. <laughs> I went to college on a soccer scholarship and, and played for a semi-pro team for a couple of years in um, in high school and uh, and then had a, a couple poorly timed injuries that made made it so that I quit and I was like bummed out about it and so I started playing in a band to like um, release my anger <laughs> and, uh, and now a decade later I'm still playing in bands to release my anger. Every member of Four Today has at least one really stupid tattoo. I have the Starbucks logo tattooed on my leg, which does get me free coffee sometimes. And Ryan has the Chipotle logo tattooed on his wrist. I guess about two years ago, I, I discovered that I'm allergic to um, rosewood, which is probably the most common fretboard, which is you know where your fingers would be played on a guitar. It's the most common wood for guitars. One thing that you may not know about me is that I'm a closet, actually not even a closet, I'm a professing Brian McKnight enthusiast. He is the best artist in the world. I would pay pretty much any amount of money to just watch him play piano in a room. He's the best. Uh, we've had a bunch of people ask what ethnicity I am. People think I'm Samoan, and they think I'm Mexican, and they think I'm Middle Eastern, um, but nobody ever thinks that I might just be a plain old black guy. Um, but I, so I hate to disappoint you, uh, but I'm, I'm, I'm half, my father was black and my mom was white, so I'm gray. Uh, we once helped the San Antonio Police Department break up a, like a crime ring. Um, I'll give you the story. We, we basically were in San Antonio. Our van and trailer were stolen. Uh, we had no clue, obviously, where anything was. We just kind of woke up and it was gone. Um, someone sent a tip to our management saying they knew where this stuff was. They wanted to get some sort of reward for it. And um, after a brief talk with our manager, we were able to get an address of like where this stuff was held. So basically, we called like the police department, and they they weren't very willing to like do much about it, even with the information we had. So we basically like posted up kind of outside their house, you know, looking for like our stuff. And we called them again, and they basically were like, you know, yeah, well, all right, give us a few minutes, we'll be down there. Um, after as soon as we gave them the address, and within about ten minutes, there was like probably like 10 cop cars that just like swarmed this, this, uh, yeah, there, <laughs> yeah, there's everything. They just like kind of showed up and they raided this house and, uh, like within a few minutes they're pulling out like guitar cabs and drums and all this stuff. And, um, one of the officers approached us a few minutes later and was like, yeah, this guy's, you know, he's got a bucket list of charges against him. He's going away pretty much for life because like, this is like the bottom rung of his, of his charges pretty much. And, uh, I guess in his house, they said he had, like, stolen machine guns, like, multiple stolen machine guns and drugs. Yeah, we ended up getting, like, a, a quarter of, of the, the equipment back, but what was more rewarding was taking a criminal off the street. There are five members in four today, and there are four different states that we all live in. Uh, he and I both live in Ohio, New Mexico, Alabama, Oklahoma. Another interesting fact you may not know about for today is that three of the five members have released albums with other bands. Uh, I was the vocalist for a band called Besieged. Sam played guitar in a band called In the Midst of Lions. And David uh, played drums in uh, the Crimson Armada. A fun fact about for today is that there's brothers in the band. My brother is in the band right down there. We've been brothers for a really long time. No matter what the internet has told you, no matter what you may think or feel, Inside of yourself, you need to know one thing about for today, and that is that we are, in fact, down to party.